The legal fallout from the deadly stampede at last week's Astro World Festival continues to grow. Dozens of lawsuits have now been filed as we are learning more about the safety protocols at the event. Casey Stiegel has more. That was probably one of the scariest things that I've ever been through. Um, gates had fallen, police were everywhere. 18-year-old Jonathan Espinoza describing the moment the crowd began surging at last week's deadly Astro World Festival. More than three dozen victims and families have now filed lawsuits, many claiming that concert organizers should have had better safety measures in place and that rapper Travis Scott should have stopped the show when chaos erupted. Anybody who encouraged or, or uh, enraged the audience into uh, coming together as this big mass uh, wave of people crushing together, those people have to be concerned. Travis Scott maintains he wasn't fully aware of what was happening while he was performing. According to TMZ, he left the concert Friday evening and went straight to an after party, but reportedly left once he was informed of the tragedy. Meantime, investigators are looking into how closely event security followed safety protocols. The president of Houston's Firefighters Union says the fire department asked concert organizers for a radio to communicate with emergency medical providers on site. He says instead they were only given cell phone numbers. The difference between uh, getting to somebody uh, in a minute or five minutes uh, is critical when somebody is in need. Houston authorities say they are still in the very early stages of investigating what exactly went wrong. That's the latest from Dallas. Casey Stiegel, Fox News.